Hello fellow Sudokans, welcome to Zen and the Art of the Guardian Sudoku Puzzle. It's Sunday the 24th of March 2024. This is the Observer uh, Puzzle, Sudoku Puzzle, level unknown. Well, at least it is to me at the moment. You may have an idea because I may have told you on the thumbnail. But at this point in time, I have no idea what kind of level it's going to be. Uh, but I suspect since we've we had hard level, I think, last week and possibly the week before, um, so I suspect we're in for an early, uh, an easy game because uh, law of averages and all that kind of stuff, you know, it must be time, surely time for an easy level game, I reckon. Um, so uh, that's what I'm going to be uh, assuming and that means I'm not going to have breakfast. It's really late. It's almost, it's definitely brunch time is, is just about gone and I'm going to hang on until lunchtime. I didn't have breakfast because uh, a YouTube channel that I used to watch ages ago uh, on live haven't been live for ages hasn't been live for ages and just happened to come on live this morning but it took much longer <laughs> it was really uh, engrossing enjoyable to take part in uh, it's very interactive and uh, took three out nothing to do with sudoku mind you uh, took more than three hours i think nearly four hours <laughs> i was just watching and taking part but forgetting to eat so uh, if you hear my stomach rumbling you will know what it is Right, uh, now if this does turn out to be an easy level Sudoku and you don't know the rules, check out any Monday Guardian for uh, how to play the game. Right, I'm going to jump in because uh, I am uh, feeling, I have a feeling uh, it's going to be time for food soon. So <laughs> just in case it turns out to be more difficult than I imagined. We've got twos starting there. I can see something else as well. Two blocking down here, down here, down here, up here and down there I should say. And that's going to give me a two in that square as well so I guess twos will be in those four squares there uh, nine across here nine up there and there Come on, where's the easy ones? Oh, all right. Let's do it like this then. can see the five, okay we've got five and nine blocking across here so that's a pair of five and nine it means that fives are here and it means that nines are there um, six, seven. Uh, okay so that's in fact five and six there so this is nine and seven yeah okay so i'll just say that five and six block these two squares that's five and six there so this has to be nine and seven so seven down there will give us the seven there and give us the nine there now back over here i discovered that was five and nine so over here or up here i should say we're looking for three and six six blocking up there there's the six there's the three So seven like this and up there, there's a seven. Two, 
two blocking here and here so in that row there's the two uh, we're looking for four and eight in those squares I think Okay, the twos are finished off. Six up there and across there. Okay, so we have seven and nine blocking down here, seven and nine across there, so that's a pair of seven and nine. I uh, don't know what else, but that's a 7 and 9. So when the 5 blocks across there, that is going to be a 5. And we'll be left here with 3 and 8. So the 8 blocking there, that's the 8. And that will be the 3. 3 going up there. There's our 3. 3 across here and here. There's our 3. Okay, eight blocking here and here, so there's the eight in that row. We're left here with what one seven is it? Uh can I say which is which not yet? Okay. clicking on digits so I've already done
All right, so time for putting on the old thinking cap. So I guess we've gone past the level of easy. It must be like a medium level game, I'm assuming, at least. Hmm. Well, I should have had breakfast, shouldn't I? Oh, hang on. Uh, I think this is one, five, six, eight. Am I right? One, five, six, and eight. Right, so five, six, and eight. Attack that square, so that's got to be a one. Thank you for something. though how does that help me not much uh, oh maybe uh, one up here so one in one of those squares blocking down one down here one across there one across there it did help me I was just awake enough to see it. I should be awake. I'm not tired. But. Uh, now, what else did I notice along here before the sixes? Okay, so six blocking down here, down here, and across there. So there's our six. Now, finally, we can get this, which is a four. Uh, Okay, so five and six blocking across here, that puts five and six into those squares. This has to be a three. Three across here and three down there makes that a three. Three up here and three across there puts a three into that square. I guess we're looking for four and eight in those squares which would make that 4 or 8 and I think it must be because I can't see the <laughs> what it is so it probably is uh, yeah okay alright so 7 blocking here this 7 blocking those squares that must be a 7 there and now this has got to be a 9, hasn't it? I'll put the 9 in here first, but you see the 9 blocking across there, that's going to be a 9. And 9 blocking up here will give us 9 in this square. And this will be a 5, and we still need a 5 for this column. 5 across this way and this way will give us a 5 here. 5 to the bottom means that's a 5, this is a 6. And... 
let's see what are we looking for one four seven uh, let's see the four and a seven so that's one seven one seven nope uh, down here we're looking for four seven eight and we got sevens blocking down like that so we can get our seven there this has to be a four or an eight which will make that four or eight and that's four or eight seems to match okay and then that's going to be four or eight which means that's going to be oh it's one of those games that's going to be four or eight All right it's one of those type games uh, finish digits are two three and nine if you're keeping score let's uh, go through and see what I'm missing uh, why am I clicking on that uh, one oh there's an empty square there I've just noticed what do I need to fill it with an eight so okay so There we go, five up there, five across there. That's the final digit, five. And now we can finish this row with a something. Six, I think. And six up here and across there will give us the six there. That's the final six. Well, these fours and eights to sort out. Uh, what else do we need? Seven. Seven blocking up there will give us the seven in that square, and then seven across here and here means that's a seven, and this will be a one, and that's a one, and then a one blocking like this will give us one in that square, and one down here means that's a one. So we're back on our fours and eights. We just need to find one. There we are. There's an eight. So that's going to be four. That's eight. That's four and we have eight here so that's the four that's the eight that's the four that's the eight the eight here will give us the four there and finish with the eight so should i call it a medium level puzzle or a hard level puzzle i don't know um not sure really but anyway it's uh one of those it's not an easy level it's definitely above that so it's either a medium or hard thank you see you around bye bye